Hey everyone, we just got in the Logitech Brio. This is the Ultra HD uh, webcam that Logitech has. It's their highest grade webcam. And in this video, we're gonna show you what this webcam is all about. And of course, do the testing so you can see for yourself how it compares as far as video quality and if the Ultra HD is actually worth it. So let's get started right now. For those of you that are new here, my name is David. This is the channel Headset Advisor, where we review and compare the latest headsets, speakerphones, and webcams to help you make a better buying decision. So hit that subscribe button and notification bell. All right, we're gonna put the technical specs up on the screen. You can pause the video if you wanna take a closer look at all the technical details of this webcam. We're gonna to get to testing out all of the 4K footage and how it compares to the other Logitech webcams here shortly, so stay tuned for that. But looking at the design of the Logitech Brio, it has a glossy uh, black finish to the front of the webcam and like a gunmetal gray to the back side of the body. Just makes it look like a very elegant, nice webcam when you mount it onto your monitor. It has an adjustable mount so you can attach the webcam to almost any thickness of display or monitor. And it also has a secondary pivot point. So if you have your camera mounted to your computer uh, monitor, your laptop, you can point the camera towards your desktop if you wanna show a document or an item on your video conferences, which gives you even more versatility. There's a privacy attachment, simply snap it onto the webcam and then you can lower the privacy filter over your camera just to increase your security and privacy. One of my favorite features on the improved design of the Brio is the USB-C port located in the back of the webcam. Previously, they were built into the body. You could not replace the cable. So now you can simply uh, plug in the included USB-C to USB-A cable that's about eight feet long and it's USB-A 3.0 plugging into the computer. The design is great, but what matters most to me is the performance and how this would work in a business application. So let's plug it in and get started and see how it performs. All right, now we have the Logitech Brio plugged into the computer and it's being recorded on the Logitech capture software. And this is in the full HDR. This is gonna give you the highest resolution. This is also in 65 degree mode, which is gonna give you the closest uh, zoom in, but then we'll switch it to the 78 degree and then the 90 degree give you an idea of how far wide it can go here. So you might want to use the 90 degree if you have multiple people in on a uh, group meeting. You might have up to two or three people with that 90 degree view. Whereas when you are using it as a personal webcam, you're probably going to want to use the 60 degree view so that you can get a nice close-up shot just like this. And this is also with a white balance auto and focus auto. So, you know, if you change the angle, it's going to automatically try to readjust uh, very quickly in order to give you a nice, sharp, clear picture. All right, looking at the quality of the Logitech C920 on the left and the Logitech Brio on the right, you can tell the C920 is in 1080p and the Brio is in 4K. You just see a lot more detail better color, more clarity, it's a much better uh, visual, as well it's in the 65 degree field of view, which helps you see the person more clearly, and you can tell the processor on the Brio does a lot better, so you can see that autofocus and white balance just perform better and smoother and makes the overall picture with the Brio much improved over the C920. So what did you think of the side-by-side -side comparison from the C920 to the Brio? How do you think the Brio performed? Drop your thoughts in the comment section below. Curious to hear your feedback. Now what I wanna do is test out the microphone built in to the Brio so you can hear for yourself the audio quality. 
All right, my voice is being recorded with our DSLR camera microphone right now. Now we're switching the audio to the Brio camera. This is what the Brio camera sounds like in a relatively quiet room. This is what you can expect it to sound like when there is no noises around you. You wanna listen for quality of voice clearly being picked up. It has two microphones built in directly to the webcam. So if you don't have a microphone or headset, this is what it's going to sound like. Of course, the speakers will still play through your laptop or your computer or your external speakers if you have them, but it only has a microphone built into the webcam so that your voice can be picked up. And this is what it sounds like. All right, now I have the Logitech Zone wired headset connected and the audio going through this microphone. I like to pair up the Logitech Brio with either the Logitech Zone wired or wireless so you can bring your video conferencing meetings to the next level. You can hear the conversation privately through the speakers of the headset, and then you have that noise canceling microphone to block out unwanted background noise so you can have even better video meetings and not distract everybody in the meeting. So this is what it sounds like when you have the microphone on the Logitech Zone wired headset. The Logitech Brio is going to take your video conference calls to the next level. As you can tell from the comparison from the C920 to the Brio, you just have more detail, you have more options as far as changing your field of view. So you can even add up to probably three or four people in a conference call and use this camera that costs less than $200 to create a great video experience. As you saw, the processor on the Brio performed great, even under uh, close-ups and uh, backing away from the camera, you could see the detail crystal clear and the speed to actually focus in and create the white balance through the auto white balance was very fast and created a good visual experience. So the Logitech Brio is one you want to consider, especially for your Zoom meetings. Of course, if you're a streamer, this is a great camera to consider. And at a price point that is uh, relatively low at $199 MSRP. It is very affordable. And of course, if you're shopping on our website, headsetadvisor.com, use the link in the description below, but make sure you use coupon code YouTube, all one word. And that's gonna get you the biggest discount possible. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I really liked the Logitech Brio. It is one of the best webcams you can get on the market so i highly recommend it big fan of the performance hope you enjoyed this video if you want to see the full in-depth review of the logitech zone wireless which is a great addition to this webcam check out that full in-depth review video right here we even do a full blender test so you can hear the noise canceling on it well, that's all i got for you Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button as we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So greatly appreciate your support. Thanks a lot. We'll see you next time.